All right, in this video, we're gonna take this SSD and we're gonna make this other computer faster by cloning the old hard drive onto this so that just daily tasks will be easier on this old computer. So the first thing I did was the DVD drive was plugged up by this cord that is SATA power and this connects the thing to the motherboard, the SATA to the motherboard. So we're gonna plug those up in the, to the back of this new SSD drive so that we can clone the old slow drive to this one so that it'll be much faster for people to use. So you just plug in the big one here to the back, make sure that's firm and they are kind of tricky sometimes. It feels like you gotta do a lot. It does slide in, just make sure you turn it the right way and those pop right in. So now I have the second drive here and we'll pull it up on the computer, run some software and we'll show you how it works. All right, so you're gonna need a software called Macrium and you can do the free version. You're gonna want to download that and you're gonna have to jump through some hoops, give them your email sort of thing. So we'll just show you and it'll give you a link in your email that you will download and it will look like this the application that you can install and it will pull up this right here where you can make sure you select the free version okay it'll download wherever you need to then after you do that it's going to ask you to put your email address and the code it gives you in your email and once you do that you'll be able to get into software that looks like this okay so up here is the old hard drive uh, that has windows on it up here and all we're going to do is we're going to clone this down here, you can see a flash drive down here uh, that I have connected, so we don't want to do that. But we have this disk here, which is my Samsung SSD that we're going to clone, right? So this is the this is one that we're cloning. It has the five partitions here. And we're going to select, all right, the Samsung SSD to clone it to, right? And we want to copy the partitions, right? Copy the partitions so that these match exactly. All right, and then we're gonna click next. Okay, you could schedule it if you wanted to, but we don't want to do that because we want to do it right now. It's just gonna double check to make sure that you're good with everything that you're copying. All right, and then we're gonna click finish. All right, it's gonna just leave all that the way it is. Okay, all right, warning. The following drives will be overwritten, want. Oh, I'm gonna make sure. Okay, now it's gonna take a while depending on how much stuff you have on there. This is a really old hard drive. We have a lot of stuff on it. And so it's gonna take a while, but we're gonna leave this running. And when it's done, I will show you what it looks like when it's done. All right, the clone is complete. So now all that's left to do is to make sure it works. So what we're gonna do is the old hard drive is in here. So we're going to disconnect that. Maybe. There we go. Now I can get to this one. There we go. All right, so we disconnected it. But again, this other one's still plugged up. So we're gonna make sure it works and boots by itself. And then we will move this, this one over here and mount it so it won't like fly around everywhere. And, but let's see if it works. The moment of truth. Baby, come on, baby. It might take it a minute. <gasps> it worked! Look how fast that was. That's awesome. And that's how we clone a hard drive. If you like this video, you're probably gonna like one of the other ones that's somewhere over here. We'll catch you in the next one.